Will we end up together? Are you both going to end up together or not? That's what we want to know today. So, let's give the cards a good shuffle. Are you both going to end up together? Going to split the deck into four, four elements, four seasons. Most importantly, four angels offering us a circle of protection. So we can give and receive all of these messages with an open heart and open mind. Down this side is you. Down this side is them. And down the middle is the connecting energy. Yeah. So let's have a look. We'll talk through it. Um see where we go from there welcome back to hope to have a daily my name's angie are you two going to end up together you've got the strength card in the recent past they've got the six of pentacles in the recent past which is showing me that you both just really like each other so much but you've had the wheel of fortune in the middle of you both and it's reversed in the recent past so there's been hold-ups delays things kind of not going your way as a couple i'm seeing you both as a couple um You've got so much love and compassion for each other. And they put in, you know, they, they put in their fair share. But there's circumstances. It's almost like you two are together in this little bubble and there's a whole world around the outside that just causes chaos and hold-ups and gets in the way. And it's like one thing after another. Um, but you're still together. You still love each other. You're still there as a unit. Whatever your status is at the moment with each other, you're still there as a unit working in the same direction together. You've got the Knight of Pentacles, which is, you know it's going to take a while for all of this to fix. They're in a place of pain at the moment with the Three of Swords reversed. feels like frustrations on their behalf. It feels like them feeling this, this is completely unfair. Um, and again, it's circumstances that are getting in the way of you both being together in the way that you want to be together. You've got the hair effect card reversed in the middle of you both at the moment, which is how the relationship is at the moment. You're both in union, whatever the status is, whether you're getting on or not, you know, you're in this union, you're both working in the same direction. It feels like because they're in this place of pain at the moment, they don't want to look at it, they don't want to address it. You're very practical. You're like, yeah, just follow me, just just trust me we're gonna get there it's like you're the grounding anchor and I don't think they're necessarily spiraling I think they're just very hurt that things are the way they are at the moment um but the Herifat card is is your connection uh, but it's reversed it's there may be someone in your life that if you sat down and told them about your situation they wouldn't understand it they'd be like what do you mean you two are together? What What do you mean you two are going to be together forever? What do you mean by that? Because um, it feels like a relationship that they wouldn't necessarily understand. Um, moving forward, you've got the Ten of Wands. They've got the King of Wands, maybe dealing with a fire sign, but I'm picking up lots of fire and earth. Um, but I don't always go towards the zodiac signs within the reading. The Ten of Wands is your determination to make it happen. It feels like within this connection, you're the stable. You're the one that's, we're doing it. We're in it. We love each other. We have a future together. Of course we do. Private readings are available, by the way. If you claim this reading, let me know. I like to know the right people got the right readings. If you want to help out with the algorithm, which would be amazing, put something in the comments, Purple Heart, anything you want, really, just to help boost the algorithm by saying hey there's something good going on over here um they've got the king of wands they're going to get their they're going to get their oomph back they're going to get their drive and motivation back and it's the both of you working in the same direction in the middle of you both we've got the three of cups reversed i do you think there's someone around the both of you who don't understand your connection um, they don't understand the way your relationship works. They kind of being quite selfish and gossiping and, and things. For the both of you to work out, the both of you need to be selfish. The both of you need to make the connection a priority. I know things are really difficult right now. 
but you know it's going in the right direction. And with them being the king of wands, they're self-made. And it's normally from a place of pain that they then have a bit of a chip on their shoulder in a positive way and make positive changes. It's almost like they're going to wake up and go, right, we're, we're doing it, we're doing it. At the moment, it feels like they're, oh, I'm just giving up, I can't, can't do this, it's just too painful. But yeah, they're going to, that oomph is going to come back. Um, the Three of Cups reversed. Don't worry about what anyone else says. You know what goes on in your relationship. You know how you and your person feels about you. Don't let anyone stir the pot or make you feel inadequate or make you feel that there's their assumptions going on. You know, they only base their thoughts of your relationship based on relationships they've had. And maybe they haven't had very good relationships. So that's that. I'm going to pull a quick nine card spread. You two are never going to actually split up. You're going to have ebbs and flows where life's a little bit difficult. But you're in it for the long haul. I'm going to pull a nine card spread because I want to see what happens after the ten of wands, after their king of wands. At the moment, you're the grounded one. You're the one that's like, trust me, we're, we're going to do it. And they're like, no, everything's terrible. You know. So... What does the bunny tarot want you to know? If you ever wonder what decks I'm using, on my website, Lover's Card, on my website is a photo of all of my decks and the names so that you can source them. I don't have affiliate links or anything like that. If you want to find them, you can find them. We've got the Lover's Card for the both of you, which is the both of you walking down this path together and you're going to end up together there's lots of passion desire but there's also choices that you both have to make at the moment the king of swords reversed is their place of pain at the moment and it's the this is unfair the world is working against us maybe we shouldn't be together anyway it's their overthinking and a death card reversed is also delays disappointment stagnation they're kind of in this headspace of they're in quite a negative headspace at the moment but you just have to you know unions are about two people propping each other up when you go through the hard times and sometimes it can be a bit of a relay, relay team you'll be going through a hard time and they have to encourage you they go through a hard time and you have to encourage them but i don't see either of you actually giving up on this connection um so then we've got the two of swords things getting better we've got the star reversed which is very much linked there's people around or there's a person around that just doesn't get it they don't understand it the hanged man reversed is going to be a bit of a limbo the two of swords is about being at that center balance and making a choice and decision don't make choices and decisions on other people's opinions make your choices and decisions on what you and your person wants not anyone else and be stubborn with it you know be really stubborn with it don't live your life to make other people happy. Live your life to make you and your person happy. Uh, we've got the Eight of Swords reversed, which is nice to see. We've got the Death card. Oh, that's the Devil. Call the Death card moving forward. And then the Two of Wands. The Devil is the Frustrations. Maybe it was meant to be the Death card as well, about stagnation. And the Death card's like, yeah, things are going to change for the better. Yeah. Um, the Eight of Swords reversed is your person kind of shutting out the negativity. For whatever reason, it really bothers them that someone's anti your relationship. And then we've got the Two of Wands, which is the both of you making plans for the future and starting the progress of making it happen. Are you going to end up together? You're never actually going to part ways. It's going to be ups and downs. There's going to be points where you think they're giving up. But on the whole... You're magnets. You're, you're in a unit. In this lifetime, the both of you are in a unit. There may be a past life connection here. There's just something really nice. It's you two against the world. But sometimes your person feels like the whole world is against them. Um, they'll come out of this negative mindset. You're their anchor. You're the person. They don't, there's no one else around for either of you. You know, it's just nice. I'm going to wrap you in a massive bubble of protection so your angels take you on your way. Thank you so much for being here with me today. If you've made it to this point, you're now part of my secret Purple Heart gang. I appreciate you being here. Hardly any of you make it right to the reading, right to the end of the reading. But I recognise the ones that do. Um, so today, Rosie's sleeping. It's raining and it's cold and it's windy. And so she's just sleeping. Um, she's a pretty little tuxedo cat. So, yeah, that's what she's doing today. But it's Sunday. She's allowed to do that, isn't she? She could do whatever she wants. Um, little diva. 
There's been a big white fluffy cat hanging around next to our garden and in our garden. Um, she needs to get back out there. Once, once the weather's warm and she's back outside in her outside dens that she chooses to live in during the summer, there's going to be so many cat fights. So many cat fights. Because all these different cats are claiming her garden at the moment. Because they're like, well, it's free real estate. So she's going to have a fight on her hands. She does it every year. I hope you're doing well. I hope whatever you do this week, you have a good week. If this was your reading, wow, what a lovely connection you've got, honestly. I know things aren't that great at the moment, but what a lovely connection. I will see you soon.